love from the love who is God. The Bible says so. Those who love are born of God and know God because God is love. 1 John 4, 7. Did you guys know that if God did not do a few things, he would be a liar? <laughs> if Jesus did not arise as the good shepherd over all mankind, he would be a liar. John 10 says he would. If the lawless one was not revealed before Christ's return, as Paul wrote in 2 Thessalonians, God would be a liar. If Elijah did not come and restore all things by God's word of the Kingdom Age Covenant, his message of Malachi 3.1 that would prepare his way, God would be a liar. And did you know that unless there was a latter-day mountain, according to Isaiah 2 and 4, in this world, the latter-day mountain of faith, God would be a liar. And did you know that God would be a liar if he threw one person in hell that was a person of love for those who love are born of God and know God because God is love, born again. And those walking with the Spirit are under no condemnation. And did you know that God would be a liar if he did not send forth his everlasting gospel as Revelation 14 says. I've written it, I've been reading it for a year. And did you know that if there was not a flying scroll of Zechariah that God would be a liar? <laughs> And did you know that if there was not to be a kingdom age ahead, God would be a liar? And did you know that there would be someone coming to feed the master's household meat while the master was away? Christ foretold that of Elijah. If that did not happen, well, God would be a liar. If one whose eyes are red of a little bit of THC. I live here in Canada at the Canadian, and it's for medicinal, I'm 60. Arthritis. So did you know that if one whose eyes were red and dull of wine if one like that did not come forth at the time of the end, God would be a liar. And did you know that God would be a liar if that one did not hold the scepter of all of God's kingdom age authority? It says so, Genesis 49, 12. And did you know that there would be a vision of God coming to pass in the last days? Actually, God said, Though it tarry, wait for it, it will surely come. It will not lie. I promise you, this will happen. Behold, he whose soul is not upright, but the just shall live by his faith, because if that doesn't happen, God would be a liar. And there would be no truth in the Bible at all. If God did not send a writer, God would be a liar, a writer. A, a liar. God foretold an end time writer. Line by line, precept upon precept, by his strong and mighty one, his end time Elijah, Joshua of uh, the book of Zechariah 3, Shiloh, Genesis 49 12, all the same guy, water, steam, and ice. The Spirit of the Lord has been upon me to teach people of our desolate heritages of Isaiah 49, 8's correct prediction. And God would be a liar if that did not happen also because that is what the Word of God predicts. And God would be a liar if there was not a latter-day Daniel 
who would embrace his destiny. Very last sentence of the book of Daniel. And God would be a liar if the shattering of the power of the holy people, if their cannons did not open again at the time's end, God would be a liar. And not only that, God would be a, 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 a liar if mankind did not beat their swords of the spirit into the sickle of his spirit that comes with the everlasting gospel, revelation of the kingdom age that has come. God would be a liar if the son of righteousness did not arise with healing in his wings as the curtain is drawn. God would be a liar if that did not happen. The kingdom age beginning. God would be a liar if by his word time was not cut short, Matthew 24, 22. God would be a liar because, well, if God did not cut time short, no flesh could be saved, total oblivion, and then the kingdom age could not come. God would be a liar if all the prophecy in the Bible had to happen. God would be a liar because he's already proved in Jonah 3 that he relented and changed his mind and then goes on the lights. He told Nineveh, I'm going to destroy you, and yet they were not. So God would be a liar if the seventh trumpet did not sound, and the first is last, and the last is first. And when the seventh trumpet sounds, the mystery of God is over. For Christ Jesus comes on the great white cloud of Revelation 14, the great white cloud of uh, Matthew 24. And it's Daniel 12, 9 time, for God would be a liar if his word did not open at the time of the end, exactly as it says. The trumpet sounds, and you hear it. Listen very, very closely. <laughs>